Love you, Mandela. Many years before the world knew you, you knew who you were, what you were born to do. You were a black man who saw so much even before you were able to touch. I believe you saw from birth the passion, the heart, that thirst. Even as a child, Mandela saw his people's need and educated himself so his countrymen could succeed. Mandela was born a bright shining star ready to lead them no matter how far. Mandela was arrested many times as the white man tried to control his mind. But what the white man didn't realize was through it all, Mandela would survive. Going into prison and suffering for many years, trying to advise his people through their grief, their tears. But God made the special man to love, to listen, to reach, and to understand. Rough and tough as he was, the world saw his passion, his heart, his love. Even not on the ground, God made sure Mandela heard his spiritual sounds to turn the other cheek, to be powerful, awesome as he'd speak. And Mandela did not fail. He used his words as a hammer to slam each nail, the nail of hope and freedom in life. His words to help his country's plight, receiving the Medal of Freedom from our shores as Americans decided to open their hearts, their doors, to look at Mandela. There wasn't much, but, this, but his actions, his voice, his heart reached and touched to help the people of the world, little innocent African boys and girls. I wonder how many times he asked why his countrymen had to suffer, why they had to die. Why was this his world so hungry for more that they took the land of their ancestors? Why was their greed so out of control that it didn't matter how they hurt the African man's soul? I wonder if he ever felt he got an answer from them as they plowed into the black man's homes, tore down beautiful trees and limbs. Now, as he is preparing to leave this earth, did he fulfill the right of his birth? Does he feel a sense of peace as our Mandela prepares for his final sleep? They say when Death comes, we have finished the task. Will, the, will his soul be still as he reaches the end of his path? We hope he leaves this world with a sense that he helped Africa's future boys and girls. And because of him, Africa is a better place. As he closes his eyes, will there be a calm on his face? We the world know he did all he could do. And we thank God for sending the world you. Mandela, 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 we love you. God bless.